tools needed for installation are seven, eight, and 10 millimeter socket, quarter inch drive ratchet, a seven eighths wrench, and a 2.5 millimeter Allen key. Install time is 30 minutes. Install difficulty is a two out of five. Loosen the bolts on each side of the ECU. Leave enough space behind the bolt heads to fit the bracket. Loosen the bolt that secures the ABS unit, which is located just behind the ECU. Again, leave enough space for your bracket. Install the Mishimoto bracket over top the bolts you loosen. The slots on the bracket will fit over each bolt. Tighten all the bolts to secure the bracket. Make sure as you tighten each one that the bracket doesn't shift or angle upward. There's a rubber bushing on the ABS unit that can get twisted if the bracket isn't pushed down while in the process of tightening. Wrap Teflon tape around the threaded section of each plastic fitting. With the threaded end facing toward you, wrap clockwise or else the tape will likely bunch up when you install the fitting. Once the tape is applied, screw the fitting into the catch can. Install the catch can to the bracket using the hardware included with your kit. Disconnect the ignition coil electrical harness to gain better access to the spring clamp at the PCV valve. To do this, lift the red tab on the harness and then depress the gray tab at the center. Compress the clamp that secures the PCV hose to the valve and slide it up the hose. Then separate the hose from the valve. Compress the clamp that secures the PCV hose to the manifold and slide it up the hose. Then separate the hose. Remove the PCV hose from the vehicle. Gather the worm gear clamps included with your kit. There is one large clamp and three smaller ones. The large one will go over the connection at the PCV valve. Find the hose in your kit with the widest diameter at the end. This is also the hose with less significant bends. Slide the large worm gear clamp over the wide end and connect the hose to the PCV valve. Then tighten the clamp. Slide a clamp over the other end of the hose connected to the PCV valve and connect it to the in port on the catch can. Check to make sure the clamp is not on the barb of the port before tightening it. Reconnect the electrical harness. Slide the red locking tab down to secure the connection. Take the other hose from your kit and feed the end with a downward bend underneath both AC lines. This end connects to the manifold. Slide a clamp over the hose at the manifold and connect it to the port. Then tighten the clamp. Slide a clamp over the other end of the hose to connect it to the out port on the catch can. 
Then tighten the clamp while making sure that it is not on the barb of the port.